welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for being here and clicking on this video and giving it a watch. If you haven't already, please consider hitting that subscribe button and joining my YouTube family. Don't forget to hit the bell button because it'll no notify you every time I upload a new video. Don't forget to hit the like button and leave a comment down below because all of those things definitely help my channel out so, so much. Um, and I am so excited to be here with you guys. So today for you, I have a Timu haul. It is some stuff that I got for Easter. It is some stuff that I got for myself. It is just fun stuff that I've picked up. Full disclosure, I probably have two more Timu hauls for you guys. I've done several orders. They've all come. I was doing Easter basket stuff, so I didn't have a chance to share them all with you when they were showing up. So um, today for you does have some Easter items in it. I know I'm a little late because it's going to probably be too late to get them, at least for this year. It's definitely too late to get them for this year, but um, I do apologize for that. That's only a few like really like Easter specific items. A lot of them are just other fun stuff. So um, I will try also to leave the links down in the description box. If I don't do that, feel free when you're commenting to ask me for a link to any of the items. And if I can get the link for you, I definitely will. I've had that happen in past videos where the item was sold out, but I found something similar and linked that. So um, if I don't get the links down there because it's a really busy week, um, just ask me and I will definitely get you the link for what I'm talking about. I also today don't know all the prices offhand. Um, because this was one I purchased when they sponsor me and they send me the stuff they really send me a really beautiful itemized list but also things vary in price all the time like it changes prices all the time so it's hard to really say what the actual price is at the day that I'm sharing it with you anyway um with that said let's get started and again I will try to link it all down below um if I do that I'll have the prices as they are the day that I upload or the day that I print like you know put that out there um but if not I will link it or I will I'll send it to you if you want to know something individually so first of all um so some of the stuff I got for my kids to put in their Easter baskets some of it is stuff for me some of it is for decoration that kind of stuff um, this one in particular, I did pick this up to do as a birthday gift. I didn't pay attention to the sizing though. So this is supposed to be a throw blanket and it is a mini, mini, mini throw blanket. So, um, I am going to probably give this to Braxton. I'm going to toss it in his Easter basket cause I'm doing a gamer themed Easter basket. And I figure he could put this on his chair that he sits in at his desk because it'll just sit real nicely on top of his chair. Um, but it was a really small throw blanket. I think the dimensions said like 30 by 40 and my brain didn't really um, do the math of how small that is, but it's little. It's not enough to cover it. I mean, it'd be good enough for a baby like a, or a toddler, but not for a kid. So, uh, but I think it'll be cute on his chair. So I'm going to let him have it for that and put it in his Easter basket for that and tell him that that's the pur purpose I bought it for. And it was only like two dollars and like 68 cents or something like that so it was really inexpensive if I wanted to I could probably let them know probably send it back but I can think of another use for it as opposed to doing that I just didn't give it as the gift instead I had run to five below and got a blanket from there for five to, I think it was 555 but it's like a regular size throw blanket and I'm totally okay with that um now as far as some Easter stuff I did buy some peeps items from them because I mean I'm really into the peeps decor this year um, and it's been really cute so one of the things I picked up are these little guys I did pick two of these ones up I'm gonna put one in my daughter's Easter basket and then probably use the other two in tear trays so let me pull one out for you guys these were inexpensive I don't remember the exact price like a dollar something I think maybe two dollars and some change but look how cute these little guys are so they're not branded like the ones that i got from dollar tree like they have little peeps brands on their butts but that's okay because they're just still super cute um they'll be cute in a tear tray probably here in the living room i might put them on my side table i have a side table over there and these would be cute over there or um i'll put them somewhere and so i got the two different colors one the, one of the teal ones is going to go in my daughter's Easter basket and then the other two will be decor for around the house. He looks a little plushier. So let's see. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's the way he was in the wrapper. They're pretty similar. I think it's just a little bit of sewing differences is all. But they're really cute and they're soft just like the Dollar Tree ones were when I picked those up. 
for $5 if, you're, if you don't watch my Dollar Tree hauls. They were in the plus section for 5 But super cute. Those little guys are adorable. So I picked those up for some Easter decor plus for my daughter. Um, let's see where to go next. So I am putting together a green chili prize basket for my sister-in-law. They're doing a green chili contest for Easter um, the night before, actually. And um, she asked me if I would put together a gift basket as their prize. And I love doing gift baskets. If you are part of my channel regularly, you know that. And they did have aprons on there um, for super inexpensive. Like, it was like super inexpensive. I mean, it's not the best quality apron. It's more for fun. And I'm going to hire my best friend actually she has her own company called genuine genuinely created it's always linked down in my description box she does wood forging and um like cricketing and so we're going to cricket on here like green chili champion 2023 and i'm going to put it in the gift basket as the prize it's 100 percent polyester it's not the biggest or best quality apron i didn't expect it to be when i ordered it for the price but it's really for the fun of it so um I mean, they had different colors. I picked the brown. I thought that that would be a good color for what it is, um, for the like the color scheme in the basket. So grab that. I think it was like a dollar and some change, if I remember correctly. And I ha they had some other ones that were like more expensive and better quality too. Like they had options on there, but I was working on a dollar limit and I wanted to make sure that I got um, all the items I wanted to for the basket. So I figured, I don't know if someone will actually wear that regularly or like hang it or use it as bragging rights. So I also picked up for the same thing for the basket. It's like a little keychain, um, and it's two little chilies. It's a red chili and a green chili. And I'm going to add that to that gift basket as well. Um, super inexpensive, 68 cents, maybe under a dollar, right around a dollar, something like that for this. Um, I just did a search for chilies or green chili. Like I try to do all the different searches to be able to pull up anything they potentially had in the chili family. And then I also grabbed these. They are um, just little chili lights. It looks like it takes two AA batteries, just like the Dollar Tree ones do. None of them are broken in the package. I'm probably going to open them up and put them in the bat, like wrap it around the basket in some sort of way. Um, put the batteries in it so that they're in there already and yeah I thought that that was really cute too and super inexpensive like $1.68 maybe um, somewhere in that realm now I got a little fun gift for my mom just for fun she just got a new house she complains a lot about the dust it's just always dusty she always pulls out her little like dust mop broom thing to just collect all the dust off the floor and I thought these would just be funny so they're like little booties that you put on your feet to dust and so it's kind of like a little gag gift for her um I'm probably gonna I'm gonna make her a little mini easter basket like one for her and my dad and I thought that I would stick this in there for fun um so I picked up two you just put them on your feet like little slippers and walk around it's supposed to dust your floor so I thought that that would just be silly little fun little gift for her and they were inexpensive and easy to grab for that. So grabbed those. Um, they come only, sorry, my nose got a tickle. Um, they only come for one. Like you, like when you order it, it comes with, wow, English. When you order it, it only comes with one. So I ordered two so that she would have a set for both of her feet. Um, I think that this is the last thing for the green chili basket. And so I want to make sure I get done with that. Um, I did pick up some socks from Dollar Tree. They were like the shorter socks. And then um, they have these ones that were the longer socks. So then that way there's a couple different options of socks. I got tacos, some chilies, and maybe then these. Maybe it's three pairs all together in the whole basket. So um, grabbed those ones. I thought they were really cute. They were a great price. Um, you're going to see more socks too because I picked up each of my kids some socks. They were all under $2, all the pairs of socks when I grabbed them. Both of my boys are into Among Us right now. They keep playing Among Us. Um, I don't know exactly what that means per se, but there's, you know, an imposter and whatever. And so they have these little stuffed 
Among Us guys. So I grabbed one. This might go in one of their Easter baskets, kind of depending on if I need to add more to them. Um, I don't. They're spoiled brats. But he was cute. He was inexpensive. I mean, maybe he can even go in an Easter egg if he if I get find one that fits. So that'll probably be part of Easter, as will this for my daughter. And a lot of what's left is Easter stuff, and it's like Easter filler stuff for the kids. So this one is just a little like coin purse. Um, they have a little piece of styrofoam on there to help keep it shape. And it's like a little bunny with a little strawberry. And she's been really into the strawberry theme stuff lately, so that's why I wanted to get it for her. Um, so it's like a bunny for Easter, but a strawberry that she likes. She can attach it to her backpack if she wants to. Um, so I think that she'll really like this. So grab that for one of her Easter gifts. For Braxton, see if you can see it without me pulling it all the way out. He's into Fortnite right now. That's been kind of like what his jam is. Um, and so every, I search regularly because sometimes different things pop up when you look up like brand name things on Tamu. And so I've been t typing in Fortnite and this regularly has been coming up. They are like dog tag necklaces very mirror like and the um little design they have a bunch of different ones so this is somebody doing the silly little dance that they do they had some with weapons on them they had just a bunch of different ones and so it's got the chain it's got the little like dog tag great quality it's definitely like a metal on there and it's like like on there so that's a really nice find and it was really inexpensive so um, again, if it's not linked down below, comment if it's something that you want the link to, and I'll get you the link very easily. So, yeah, that's that was a cute little find for him for a little Easter edition. Now, this I thought was really cute. I don't know if this is for me or for Lorelai. Probably for Lorelai. She's getting a Peeps-themed basket, and so it's always fun to find, like, the little additions you can get for, for their basket, especially for inexpensive and it's like a little makeup bag. It says, hanging with my peeps. And it's got the little peeps on there. Um, just a little bag. I thought this was really cute. Um, very like just burlap, burlap consistency. The zipper I would compare to like the Dollar Tree makeup bag zippers. So not terrible quality and really cute for her Easter basket. I did get Braxton a mouse pad. It is a light up one. I got it at Five, or at uh, either Five Below or Dollar Tree, I can't remember, but it was like the $5 one. And I thought each of the kids might like a really fun designed mouse pad. So Eric's into dinosaurs, so I got him a dinosaur one. Um, they did each get Chromebooks for Christmas. And so this is like if they wanna use these for their Chromebooks. I got them the plain um, mouse pads. I just each got a plain black one, but this just makes it a little bit more fun. And then Lorelai likes corgis um, and corgi butts. I don't get it, but it's something she likes. And I thought that that was a really cute mouse pad for her. And I think these were each like two something, if I remember correctly. And now I did get them each a pair of socks. Let's see if all the socks are like right here, but okay. So I did get them each a pair of socks because they had them in their kind of themes-ish. So Lorelai's theme is peeps, but she likes corgis, so I found a lot of cute corgi stuff. So I was grabbing that. But I got Eric some dinosaur socks. He likes these tall socks when he wears his cowboy boots because, you know, it covers his legs up when he wears his cowboy boots. So I thought he would get a kick out of those. Um, Braxton, he doesn't wear cowboy boots, but sometimes they do a fun sock day at school and stuff during spirit weeks. And so these ones are the Nintendo game controller on there. And so I thought that that would be cute um, on like those days that they do like fun sock day and stuff. And in the summer, if you ever wanted to, you could wear them and wear them with the shorts and stuff because he really likes the Nintendo controller and it um, matches some of his other stuff that I got in his Easter basket. And then Lorelai got corgi socks. And they're literally like the little corgi butts. 
and she just likes fun socks period they'll be too big for her hopefully they'll shrink a little bit in the washer but she just likes corgi butts so i think she'll get a kick out of those what else so this one i don't remember why i got both this and the little one but it's like a little boba but with strawberries like a little milk tea kind of keychain she loves this kind of stuff these i will probably for all of these things look for the bigger easter eggs and do these for their easter egg hunt in there um or the easter bunny might put them in those now these i was really excited about these are going to be used with some of my easter decor probably on my coffee bar and they are little peeps wooden beads so they got the beads on there the jute twine we got the pink the blue and the purple with the little bunny peeps these again i'm sorry these are a little late because we are right there at easter um, but maybe you could still find them for next year so picked those up i think i don't remember the price of this maybe five ish dollars for these maybe i can't remember for sure sorry um, but it'll either be linked down below or you can ask me and i'll send you the link um, for Easter eggs, again, I grabbed, I was looking for, sorry, I have a tickle, little things to put into Easter eggs because Easter egg hunts for the kids. And, um, I don't like to just do a bunch of candy. I always try to find little things. And honestly, Timu was full of fun little things. So Lorelai is still into like the real littles and littles and just little teeny tiny things. And this was a set of little dogs. So we have this little guy. Oh, this one's a cat. So we have a little cat laying there. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. And these would just be perfect to toss into Easter eggs because they're just small. Got that little guy like barking. Okay, I have a hair that shedded and it's like sticking to everything. This one's like a little chihuahua. Oh my gosh, how cute. These are even cuter, I think, than I expected them to be. It's like a little puppy. I need to hurry up. I have a lot more stuff to share with you guys. And that little guy. So one, two, three, four, five, six of them. Um, good for Easter egg. So I picked those up for like Easter egg um, stuffing. That, that's a lot of what's in here. It's just like little things like to be able to put in Easter eggs. I dropped one, so I'll toss that down there. These two. So these are Among Us little like lego figures not lego inspired figures so i don't think anything that they actually have is like lego and so when you get them they come in a little wrapper like this that you can put them together so this is exactly how they're going to go in easter eggs this looks like there's two of them in here and so both of the boys i'm going to split these up between the boys we got two of them in there and they're all like the different color among us so those are going to get split up. There's a whole bunch in here um, between their Easter eggs. So we do color coordinate. The Easter bunny does a color coordination of the Easter eggs and like leaves them a little note of which colors they're supposed to be looking for um, because the three of them kind of get different things in their eggs. So this one is for Braxton for my oldest. For his, he's getting a gamer themed basket. This is a light up mouse that's wireless and rechargeable. Um, I was all for the rechargeable because we have a problem with the batteries always running out and so a rechargeable one is amazing and then this line around here lights up it glows like LED and so he has needed new new mice new mouses over and over and over again this year for school so hopefully this one lasts but it was only like five or six bucks so super inexpensive and rechargeable which I was like heck yeah because the battery life in those things have not been great so that's for his Easter basket I also got him these they are LED lights I picked up one of these once before but this is a lot like a longer strand of them it comes with a little remote control in there you do have to buy the battery separate I had ordered two of these one of them went in his friend's birthday gift um, but they are exactly the same I tried them out before I gifted them to make sure they worked and they did they don't have a white color light they just have green blue and red i believe and so if you push purple like blue and red light up because that's what makes purple but they don't like actually glow purple and so that's what that looks like um and i'm going to put those in his easter basket because 
he saw that we gave them to his friend and he's like, oh my gosh, I would love to have some LED lights. And I'm like, yeah, I know. And he will because I'm going to put them in his Easter basket. This one is a Spinosaurus put together dino. I bought a bunch of these in a past to Mohaw for Eric. Um, I don't know if this is going to be for his birthday or for Easter, but he loves the Spinosaurus. That's his favorite East or his favorite dinosaur. So I wanted to get him that. Um, I actually accidentally ordered two of them, but he will, I'm sure, be just fine with that. So he got two Spinosauruses. Um, I got a little gamer poppet for Braxton. Both the other two got a bigger poppet of like their themes. Um, he just got a small one. It'll be just fine. These, oh, there's there's more than one of some of these items. This is another little keychain gamer thing. Supposedly it's like a little game that you could play. So I got that to put in one of his, either his Easter egg or one of his, um, no, in his basket or one of the eggs. All of these have multiple of like the same thing. So I'm trying to grab them all. This is just a fake Spinosaurus, like a dinosaur, but it's a Spinosaurus, which is Eric's favorite dinosaur. So I wanted to get him that. Um, $2 and some change, I think, but again, um, either linked down below or um, ask me in, in the comments and I'll let you know if that's something you want to know. This is a little, like just a little Easter egg and it's filled with like dino erasers. So it's just a whole bunch of small dino erasers. Super cute. I don't remember how many erasers you get in it, but um, I'll probably just put this inside another Easter egg for him to find. But it's like just a bunch of little erasers that are dinos. They're so cute. So I think he'll totally dig that. This is one of the things I was really excited to see on Timo. It is like their little heads. That sounds real weird like um fossils of dinosaur heads and i got this for easter eggs for the easter egg fillers so this one is my favorite dinosaur it's the triceratops i think this was like five bucks and i think there's 12 of them in here if i remember correctly and they had them in two different colors a lighter color and a darker color so that one goes like that so super neat like i think he'll dig this too they're like little dino skulls and he loves dinosaurs so there's just a whole bunch in there i see a t-rex i couldn't tell you what they all are i bet he can because he like knows that stuff um but super neat little doodads that i think he is going to be like excited for he's gonna dig that um my nieces and nephews are coming over for easter i'm building them little easter egg or easter baskets and one of my my sister-in-law they're like a pizza eating family they like love pizza oh this one's taped all the way around and this is just like a little fake pizza i thought it was really cute so there's one two three four five six pieces i bet it makes a circle and they're just like a little pizza toy and it was like two dollars i think give or take so super cute that's going in my niece's easter basket since they're coming over for for easter this one is a keychain. I did order this in red and in black. I gave the red one as a gift to um, my son's friend for his birthday party the other day. But then this is the black one and it's going to be in my son's Easter basket. And it's going to go in the basket since his friend got it for his birthday. So he's not like, see, the Easter bunny is not real. These are a bunch of scrunchies. I think there's 12 of them in here and it was like $2. And my daughter is addicted to scrunchies. She like... This always, always has a scrunchie. It's like a smaller one, which isn't necessarily bad. And they're all fuzzy, like super cute. Like they feel really soft. So I got her, it almost feels like it's a coil in there. I'm sure it's not, but it feels very coily. So I got her all of these. They're going to go in Easter eggs um, because that's something she's into and it's usable. And I feel like it makes sense to do usable items as opposed to you know, just so much candy and stuff. So for some of hers, they all got some Lego figures. And because we're a Lego family, we love Legos. And they're Lego inspired. Um, I got her this one. It is a little Easter bunny. One. 
And so there's like the ears in there. There's the carrots. It's hard to see it all the way that they're in there. The little person that turns into an Easter bunny. I don't know if I'll build it. I might build them and put them in the Easter eggs because this packaging just doesn't look Easter bunny-ish. And then I got her this one, which is a unicorn. How cute is that? The little unicorn head, hands, um, and yeah, the head. And then it's got little stars. So these are Lego inspired. They're not really Lego, but, and the, I think they're like a dollar or like 68 cents. Some of them were 68 cents. Some of them were a dollar. Um, on that note for Eric, there's one more, one more in here. Aha. I got these. They are like little dinosaur Legos. Um, they have these little guys in some of the Jurassic World sets and they had these three or four, four different colors with the little egg. I don't think they fit in the egg, but they're just in there with it. So we got the yellow and the white and the gray and the black. And so I'll put those each in an Easter egg for him because that's his jam, like the dinosaurs. I got one of each for them of these. They're like metallic color Lego people. And so we got the rose gold one and that's gonna go to Lorelei. And I think I'll build these and just put them in as the Lego person. Um, I got the blue one for Eric and then the gold one for Braxton. Like they don't have faces, they're just like all monochromatic of the color. So I think that they'll all love that. And they just got told that we're going to Legoland. So right now, like anything Lego has been really exciting the past couple days because we're going to Legoland in the summer. This is a set of dinosaur stickers. Um, not sure if it'll be for Eric's birthday party or it'll probably be for his party. I'll probably save these for his party and do them like in their um, goodie bags and stuff like that. But it was a nice big set of stickers for an expensive 50 pieces in there. But that'll go to the side for his birthday. This is super cute. So all the kids like Coca-Cola. Like they say that that's their favorite soda pop. And so it's like a little flat and it says Coca-Cola on it with a bunch of little Coke bottles that fit in there. And so I thought that that would be cute for one of Lorelai's Easter eggs. And then... This, I don't know if I'm going to do for his birthday party. There's only eight of them, so it's hard to say, but they're little dino skeletons. So these either will go in Easter eggs or um, be saved for his birthday party. Being that I'm doing dinosaur for his Easter theme and for his birthday theme, I kind of have some wiggle room on which is which. Lastly, for the kids, and then one thing for me, this is like a dino buildy thing. Like, so it curls up into like an egg shape but then like it opens up into a dino shape. Um, I feel like it was the Spinosaurus because that's why I think I got it, but it might not be, I can't remember. Or maybe they just sent a random one of that. Um, it just, I don't know about the quality of that. It looks a little less than, but I mean, he'll still be excited for the dino. Last thing I'm excited to share is something I picked up for myself and that is a pair of shoes. I tried to pick these up numerous times in hauls and they kept being sold out before I got the order in. And so this time I was finally able to. Um, they are very light, very, very lightweight. I got them in a size like seven, I believe, which is typically my size. They got the white soles, the little shoe. They're kind of like Hey Dudes is what I was going for. Um, I wanted like a Hey Do inspired shoe. So I'll try them on. I'll let you guys know. They're really light. They might be really flimsy, but they might be cute with some outfits. That's kind of what I was thinking some of my outfits will be cute with. So I picked those up. They do need to get their shape back because the way they were in there, they're a little misshapen. Um, guys, phew, that was a lot. That was my Timu haul. I have so much more to share with you from Timu. That's coming up. Maybe next week I'll do one. Um, maybe I'll do one each week until I get through all the Timu stuff I have. I have a couple more things on their way too, because I just can't stop. So keep an eye out for future Timu hauls. I hope you're having a wonderful week. I hope you're all prepared for Easter. If you do anything for Easter, I hope you're enjoying your week no matter how you enjoy it. I can't wait until I see you guys next time. You have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. Bye guys.